What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and today we have a little bit of news about the rise of Iron. Not much to go on though, just what was mentioned within the update which dropped last night, which if you guys missed I will link it in that video description. Now in the update they go on to say that on Wednesday July 20th we will get a little look at the changes made to the Cosmodrome. This will come around the time of 10 a.m. Pacific, which I do believe is around 6 p.m. UK time. They state in the update though that this will not be an incursion into the Plague Lands, that's for later. Before your adventures into the new territories begin, you're invited to join us for an exploration of how the world you know has changed with the passage of time. I think on this stream they will mention towards the end of it when we can expect to see a little in look into the plague lands, but that won't be for quite a while. For me though, I'm more excited about how the game performs and what it looks like on current gen only. If they have made basic changes to the core of the game, like how guardians walk upstairs, I can't imagine some of the other mechanics added and the features we could witness. That excites me more than seeing DLC as crazy as it sounds. Now while we are on the subject of current gen, legacy consoles that being the PlayStation 3 and the Xbox 360 from August 16th this year will no longer receive major Destiny updates or content releases. On this date, the account import process will become available on PS4 and Xbox One consoles for you guys to transfer all your data from Xbox 360 or PS3 to current gen. From this date forward, progression will no longer be shared between console generations within the same console family. Moving on, and the Iron Banner is returning, fuck yes. Let's just hope though that the first few days ain't fucked like the last ones were. I mean shit, I ain't never seen so many contacting Destiny server messages in my life. That shit was crazy. Now the Iron Banner starts on Tuesday July 19th which is next week and ends on the weekly reset the following week. Game mode is control. Armors this time around will be the gauntlets and leg armors as seen on screen now. PS exclusive armor will be the gauntlets also. Iron Banner weapons we will see are the sniper rifle which could be interesting seeing some of the roles people get and the pulse rifle again could be great with the right roles. So yes Iron Banner next week I personally cannot wait. But guys that's about it from the weekly update but if you do want to know more about legacy consoles and how they will be affected the update is linked in the video description anyway guys hope you enjoyed the video and i'll catch you on that next one peace out until next time peace always in the wrong knowing where we stand Get it right, left in the dark.